All right, guys and girls, it's Neil from Neil College Recording. Thanks for watching this video. So today we are talking live streaming. What's it all about? So live streaming is something that I've wanted to introduce into my channels and my branding for a while now. I do see a lot of benefits in live streaming. And it's a good way to get your audience involved. I have found in the past though, with a relatively small channel, it's quite hard to get people to actually watch the stream live. But obviously in time that grows and when people see you online they're more inclined to join up with your live stream so i have started doing them on my facebook you may have, may not have seen them but if you're not already go ahead on over to my facebook page and follow that page and you'll see my weekly live streams where i just basically give you a rundown of what's been going on in my week i find them useful I think you'll find them useful. I just think it's a, a good way to communicate with your audience. So when Restream got in contact with me and asked me to do a few videos for them, it came at an ideal time. So this video is sponsored by Restream, but they haven't told me what to say. I'm just gonna tell you my first thoughts on this software. So live video can really enhance your channel's branding and it gives your viewers a really engaging experience in a way they're just having a one-on-one -on -one conversation with you. It's only going to get more popular as the social media world expands. With Restream, it's really easy to create professional looking live streams. Now here's the kicker. You can stream live to 20 plus platforms with Restream all in one go. So within the Restream interface, you can share your live stream with 20 plus different platforms all at the same time. That's a game changer. So there's also Restream Pairs. I'm going to be doing a separate video on that, which you'll be able to find here. That's going to be my next video in the series. Now, Restream Pairs has taken that one step further. Definitely subscribe to my channel and tune into that video because I'm going to show you how to get 100 times more viewers by using Restream Pairs. It kind of blows your mind where Restream are going with their software. So use the link in the description below and you're going to get your first month on Restream free of charge. The good people at Restream have given me this link so that you guys can try it out for free. So let's run through a few of the features on Restream that kind of sets it aside from other streaming software. As I've already said, you can stream to 20 plus different platforms all at the same time. Now that's huge. Usually you can just stream to one platform and then share it to others after. With this, you can just stream live to 20 plus different platforms. Now within the Restream software interface, you have access to the analytics for each of those separate social media channels. So whichever channels you live stream to, you can individually see the analytics for each of those channels all on the one screen. Don't have to go to YouTube, find out the analytics there. Facebook, find out those analytics. It's all in the one screen on Restream. So that's amazing, just have it all in one place so you can see exactly what's going on. You can also stream in full HD. It's been tried and tested by the people at Restream. I had a quick go earlier and there were no issues with live streams, especially these days. You don't want them to be going out all pixelated. You want nice, clear live streams. And it's full HD all the way with Restream. So there's another reason to use Restream to stream your live videos. Are you still with me? Good. So say you have a video already put together that you want to live stream, but you've already made the video, then you can upload that video and you can schedule it to go live at a certain time on all channels. So you can be away, asleep, doing something else. You could be, I don't know, windsurfing, whatever. And your live stream will automatically go live to 20 plus channels or less, however many you choose, and you don't even have to be there. It's got a great little scheduler on there. That's pretty cool. Works exactly the same as a normal live stream, and you'll get all the analytics through as you would with a normal live stream. In effect, it is a normal live stream. It's just not live. It's a video that you've scheduled. You also get 24-7 support from these guys. If you have any issues, they've got nice, easy chat to access, so you should be able to get any issues sorted quickly and efficiently. I work silly hours, so having 24 seven support is always good for me. I think these days really good support teams is becoming more and more important because people want their problems solved straight away. So having 24 seven support is good. But I already use Zoom, Ecamm, OBS, I hear you say. It's not a problem. You can integrate that seamlessly 
with this software. You can still be streaming via these mediums. It'll go out using this software. So in effect, you're turning your OBS Solitary 1 live stream into a 20 plus platform live stream. Pretty cool. So when you're actually streaming, if anyone does send you any messages, then you get all of your messages in one place. It doesn't matter which platform they come from. It will tell you which platform it's come from on the message and it will just list them in one long list. Easy to read, easy to see where it's come from, easy to reply to, you know. They can't really make that bit much easier for you. All comes into one central message area in the Restream software on the screen. Really simple. Love it. Now, if you're the type of person that streams with other people, then you can have up to 10 streaming hosts. So 10 of you can all stream together, any more than 10. And it's that's, that's going to be difficult to see whose turn it is to talk next, surely. It's just going to be a mess. You can also play recorded video pre-rolls so before your stream starts you can play like an intro video a bit like the one that I used to use on my channel that I don't really use anymore but you can use these sort of intro pre-rolls before the actual live stream on restream another cool feature you can also customize your stream with logos and overlays now this like some of the other features only works with a paid version but to access some of the key features on this i would suggest one of the paid versions is probably a better option for most people anyway if you're a regular live streamer that's probably the way that you're going to go now on the screen as i'm talking i'm just putting up the different price plans so that you can have a look and see what you get with each price plan so that you guys can just have a quick look through them when you've got a paid plan then you'll be able to customize your stream so as you can see from my video here, you can add your logo and it'll appear in the top corner. You can also add backgrounds. I've just added this random one for now, but you can add backgrounds to your stream. You can also add captions as the stream's going out. All sorts of things that you can customize in Restream to really brand your stream and make it your own. So that's it for this video. It's just a quick overview of Restream. Like I said, my next video is gonna be on Restream Pair, so don't miss that one. I'll show you how to get 100 times more views on your live streams using Restream Pairs. The video will be here or at the end of this video. If you have enjoyed this and found it useful, please do give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Let me know if you've used this software, if you plan to use this software, and if you have any questions, just pop them in the comments below. Please do consider subscribing to this channel. Then I can let you know when any future Restream videos come out. And also you can have a look at the other videos on my channel. It's all useful filmmaking stuff. I think it's useful anyway. I spent a lot of time on these videos. So it'd be nice if people subscribed. Let's carry on building that community. It'd be good to have some new faces on board. That's it for this one. Use the link in the description below. Go and grab yourself a copy of this software and try it out. I'll catch you in the Restream Pairs video.